Okay. Uh, hi, Anjali. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Uh, introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Anjali Singh. Uh, I am an electrical engineer. I have done my B.Tech from Motihari College of Engineering, Motihari, with 76.79 percentage. I have done my intermediate from Divine Public School, Monapur, Gorakhpur, with 75.4 percentage. I have done my matriculation from Divine Public School, Monapur, Gorakhpur, with 8.2 CGPA. Uh, coming to my technical skill, I am good at uh, SAP, MM, uh, Microsoft Office, including MS Excel, MS Office. MS PowerPoint and uh, uh, MATLAB. That's all about my technical skill. Thank you, sir. Uh, what is your key strength in SAP? Uh, my key strengths are I'm good at uh, P2P cycle and uh, material management and uh, inventory management and uh, uh, physical inventory. That's all. Oh, OK. Uh, what is P2P cycle? Uh, basically, P2P cycle is a procurement to pay cycle uh, in which we do some processes like, uh, uh, first of all, we create purchase requisition that is ME51N. After that, uh, we create purchase order uh, that is the T code is ME21N. After that, we uh, go for goods receipt that is MIGO MIGO. After that, uh, we do invoice receipt, that is MIRO, M-I-R-O. This this uh, end-to-end process is called P2P cycle. OK, uh, what is inventory management? What, sir? Inventory management, do you have any idea of inventory management? Inventory management is the process in which we uh, keep the stocks and change the status of stock. Uh, and uh, we manage the stock position that is called inventory management. Uh, what about physical inventory? Physical inventory. Uh, physical inventory is the process in which we physically count the stock which is available in the uh, uh, stock area. And uh, the process of physical inventory is uh, first of all, we create. PI document, the T code of PI document is MI01. After that, we print the PI document. Then after we uh, check the difference of uh, uh, book stock and uh, uh, physical counted stock. Uh, and the T code is uh, for posting, I'm uh, sorry, for uh, counting difference is MI04. After that, uh, we, if required, we uh, recheck the uh, physical inventory or recount. Then after we go for um, posting of uh, that difference and the T code is MI07. That is called physical inventory process. Okay. Uh, what is the T code for the recounting process? Um, recounting, sir, sorry, sir, I don't know. Mm, T code. Uh, that is MI11. Uh, if uh, I want to see the history uh, of physical inventory, which T code uh, should I use? Sorry, sir, I don't know. Okay, fine. Uh, is it okay. okay. What is the process of setting? Linking the FI to the M finance model to M module. Sir, so actually, uh, my module is uh, M module, so I don't know uh, FI. Oh, sorry, sorry. Um, sir, I know uh, linking. Uh, we do account assignment category for linking FI to M. MM. Uh, what is pricing procedure? Types of pricing procedure? Uh, pricing procedure is of, um, I think, three types. Uh, I don't know the depth, but uh, I know the basics. That is uh, one domestic price pro pricing procedure, uh, international pricing 
and uh, within plant pricing procedure only i know this this and uh, some procedures are uh, we go for um calculation schemas and uh, so first of all we go for conditional uh, pricing then pricing schemas these all other the steps of pricing procedure uh, sir i know only this much about pricing procedure okay uh, for the what is the moment time for plant to plant stock transfer plant to plant to stock transfer moment type is 301 And uh, stock transfer uh, is the process in which we uh, we move move physically or uh, we go for book stock. for transfer of a stock from one place to another place whereas in transfer posting we go for the uh, change of status of a stock that is uh, from quality to block to block to quality or unrestricted to quality or quality to unrestricted this is transfer posting okay uh, suppose that uh, in the company there is a material which is useless and that can't be sellable that can't be sell so what steps do you follow we go for transfer posting and we scrap that uh, uh, material from moment type 551 tick code sorry sir i don't know tick code of scrap uh, the tick code is uh, i think i think me go me go sorry me go what is uh, difference between pr and po uh, pr is a internal document that is purchase requisition and uh, po is a legal document which uh, which legal and external document which involves all the formalities and uh, processes in po Okay, you are applying for a consulting position. So, do you have knowledge of assignment and configuration? What sir? As you are applying for a consulting position, so do you have knowledge yeah. of assignment and configuration? Yes, sir, I know. Okay. Uh, what is the assignment? Uh, what is the assignment process? consignment process consignment process is the procurement process a special type of procurement um, in which uh, we uh, give the raw material to the vendor and after that a uh, vendor gives uh, after consuming that raw material uh, vendor gives us a finished good that is consignment process and the process includes uh, first of all we go for uh, Uh, only this much. This is a concern. Uh, subcontract. Subcontract. Sir, you are asking for subcontracting or consignment. Consignment process. Consignment. Sorry, sorry, sir. Uh, I have your wrong answer. Uh, consignment process is the process in which we take a stock from the vendor in our plant, and after that we consume the plant. Uh, that is called con consignment process. Uh, in consignment process uh, that's all in consignment process okay what is subcontracting uh, subcontracting process is the process in which we give the raw material to the vendor and after that uh, after that uh, vendor consumes that raw material and uh, and gives uh, finished good to us that is a contracting process Can I explain with the tick code and uh, what type used in it? Uh, okay. First of all, we create material. 
uh, of uh, two types that is raw material and uh, uh, finished material by using t code mm01 then we go for pir purchase into record of uh, fault material then we go for creation of bomb uh, bom bomb for uh, by using t code cs01 then we go for uh, po creation me uh, po for uh, me 21n then uh, in po we uh, give component details of raw material and uh, um, we give raw material as a component after that uh, um, we go for uh, issue of uh, stock to the vendor or uh, by using t code me me o me to o uh, for issuing goods to the vendor and the moment type is 5 or 1 and after that uh, uh, we go for mego good receipt uh, and uh, good receipt and uh, vendor consumes that raw material and uh, the uh, background in that background that uh, moment type will be 543 and uh, we uh, go for me we go using t code uh, using moment type 101 after that uh, we do the uh, miro that is called uh, उंटेंट इंपॉर्टेंट और नॉट वेंडर मास्टर is also in, important without my vendor master we can't go for purchase in uh, such a value okay what is the code for vendor master vendor master bp okay. uh, do you have a have knowledge of material group and material type yes sir i know material group and material type what is the difference between them Uh, material group is a certain type of group of materials mm, we can say that uh, certain parts of a certain good but uh, material type is the material in which uh, we go for the certain type like raw material and uh, uh, fault is a this all are type of material and uh, material group can be fault raw or, or any Consume 
uh, your voice is uh, um, okay. uh, lagging or external voice is coming. Again, we can change the product in consignment process. Okay. Yes. So, yes, so reach moment type is proceeded. Four one one. Consumption for consumption for yes, yes. for consumption. Ah, uh, four one one. K. Yeah, four one one. K. Okay. What item category is used in consignment and subcontracting? In consignment, we use K, and in subcontracting, we use L. Subcontracting L and consignment uh, K. Okay, thank you. Thanks for your uh, thanks for your time. Thank you, sir.